All right, we're here with Mr. Nile. This is actually my high school roommate, for those of you who don't know, which is wild. Yeah, pretty cool. Anyway, the, one of the hardest questions in fitness, okay? So what's that condition or that metric, that parameter of that supplement that discerns it from being natural or not? I would assume just uh, unnatural ingredients and processing. Because all these things are technically derived from natural substances, but everything has to be derived all process maybe it means it's not so let's take testosterone which is of course a natural hormone let's extract it from the body which is actually possible to do and then inject it into someone would that be considered natural because it's literally a natural hormone i think no so that's the problem you can inject testosterone or you could take a clomiphene that boosts the testosterone so what's to say the gray line of you injecting or you taking a supplement to secrete more. I did a YouTube video on this actually with a, do you guys know um, Marshall Cruz? Yeah. Yeah, so I did a YouTube video with him and Greg Duchenne did like a follow up basically because uh, Marshall took in clomiphene and ACG from a clinic and didn't know that like people were saying it would mean you're still natural because you're boosting your natural test. Then Greg and some other people came up with the argument that ACG is a hormone and you're injecting into your body so you're not natural anymore. This is the problem. You can't say that, oh, if it's a hormone and you put it in your body, that makes